Welcome to EndNote 2025. In this short video, you'll get a fast start guide to essential tasks, creating a library, importing references, exporting from external databases like PubMed, creating a custom group, finding full text PDFs, and citing in Microsoft Word. Let's get started. To create an EndNote library, go to the File menu and choose New. Select a location on your Mac, such as your home folder, and assign a name to your library. Be sure not to save EndNote libraries you're actively developing inside a CloudSync folder, such as iCloud Drive or a networked location, as this can cause library corruption. Press the Save button in the bottom right corner of the window to complete this process. Let's add some research materials with online search. Select a connection file at the bottom of the Groups panel, such as Crossref. Enter your search terms and press the Search button. Review your search results and highlight the ones you want to keep in your library. Press the plus icon to add them to your library. Click on your All References group to confirm these items successfully copied. To use direct export from the PubMed.gov website, perform your search of the database while in a web browser. Click Send to button and select Citation Manager. Specify the search results to export and press Create File. Then, locate the newly saved temporary file in your Downloads folder and double-click it to import the exported references into your active EndNote library. To organize your research, click Create Group from the Groups menu. Give your new custom group an appropriate name. Then, drag and drop references into this new group. Highlight one or more references in your library and click the Find Full Text shortcut on your library toolbar to find and attach full text PDFs. If available, EndNote will automatically attach PDFs. Look for the paperclip icon to confirm that the operation was successful. In Microsoft Word for Mac OS, place your cursor where you want the citation to appear. From the EndNote 2025 tab along the ribbon at the top of your document, Click the Insert Citation shortcut. Use this window to perform a search of any open EndNote libraries for matching references. Highlight a search result and press Insert when you're ready. Your in-text citations and bibliography will update automatically. Click the Style drop-down menu on the EndNote 2025 tab in Word at any time to change your output style. Choose from your favorites or press Select Another Style to match your formatting requirements. In this example, we'll select APA 7th. To add cited page information to an in-text citation, highlight a citation in Word, and click the Edit and Manage Citations button on the EndNote 2025 tab. Enter the cited page details in the Pages field, then click OK. EndNote will update the citation accordingly. You're now ready to start working smarter with EndNote 2025. For more tips and training, please visit the EndNote LibGuide.